There has been a lost 26, 25, up to 30. It's visible by eyesight. Three metal detectors are now here. Woo! G'day guys, welcome back to Lost Recovery. Today I've got some awesome news. Now I've read your emails, I've read your comments. You guys have been wanting free metal detectors. Now it's here on our channel. The brand new Nocta Macro Pulse Dive 2-in-1 metal detector. Both pinpointer and metal detector. Waterproof to 60 meters. This thing is an absolute beast. I found plenty of gold out there in the ocean with it. And now, it's all yours. If we hit 10,000 likes on this video, I'm giving one of you a brand new Nocta Macro Pulse Dive. And it's all for you. Halfway through the night, metal detecting. We get an emergency call on Bondi Beach. Now, a lady has unfortunately lost. That was given to her by her father many years ago. We are gonna go out there. Check that out. That is a three meter drop down there. All that sand gone out the ocean. All along the coastline. Two to six meters drop. And we're gonna do some metal detecting. See what we can find. Gear up, get out there. Woo. Oh. Whoa. That is some heavy erosion, eh? That is. We're down to black sand, check this out. Black sand. We're on peak high tide, unfortunately. We're gonna be scanning a couple of beaches and we're gonna see exactly what else we can find out there. Now in 1974, there was a wall that was actually protecting the coastline down the south end and that has just been swept away. It's just, it's gnarly out here. So I've got a 17, 18, and we're right next to the access point on the beach. So there should be some pretty good targets here. Let's dig it. Cent. First target, a crusty 50 cent coin. Now, that is a heavy coin. That means we're on some heavy targets. So this entire area could be loaded with gold. Oh, there we go. A 20, 21. Another heavy target. One dollar. Yeah. Let's keep going. Sold 21. That could be a two or one dollar coin, and it's right underneath. Have a look at that drop. A Ten foot drop at this point down there. It's over four meters. Rusty $2 coin. 
Let's keep going. One two dollar coins. One dollar. Good guys, let's keep going. We're at the north end of Bondi Beach. There has been a lost silver ring with a red sapphire. Now this was a gift from her father many years ago. She's really distraught that she's actually gone and lost it. Given me a search area done by photo. It's pretty accurate. I've just got to use the landmarks behind me, triangulate my position. I can miss the ring by basically a foot. We don't want to do that. I don't want to be out here all night, even though I'm going to be out here all night because the storm has just been hitting and there's a ton of cash and gold out there to be found. Let's gear up, get out there. The ring's here and we will find it. it up as a 29 and a 30 and not only that it's visible by eyesight it's not even buried 26 25 up to 30 can you see the ring just glimmering in the light i can't believe it that was actually lost two days ago it's been sitting by ramp 7 on bondi beach for two days for everyone to see there's a lot of foot traffic there's a lot of people that walk along here there's a lot of runners that come here every single day and to have this ring just staring up at us like that, that's, uh, yeah, <laughs> I've lost for words. That is absolutely insane. For the slow reveal, so it should have a red sapphire in it. Oh, you beauty. There we go. That is a ring. Dear little beauty. That is a beautiful ring. It's way too late to call up the owner. Quick photo, a lot of weight lifted off their shoulders. This ring was given to her by her father. She was really distraught when she lost it. And to be able to actually find it, anyone could have found that over the past two days. I can't believe so many people walked past this ring and didn't see it in the sand. We'll send over a message to the owner, give her the good news. Photo of confirmation, we'll send him a little ring, thumbs up, send. Unfortunately the owner couldn't be here with us tonight, she lives about an hour and a half away from Bondi. The most important thing, reassurance, there's a lot of sentimental value, she's losing sleep over it for the last two days. The last thing she really needs to worry about is her ring being lost when in fact it's not. We found it. I drive this out to lock up. It'll remain there. Next week she can collect it. What an absolute beautiful night on Bondi Beach. The stars are out. It's a gorgeous night. She is an absolute little beauty. You can see the ring. Definitely got some age to it. Really happy that I could get it back. That's it for today. Subscribe and I'll see you all on the next hunt. Happy hunting guys. Cheers. Haha. <laughs>